good to see you again. Hello. Hello. Yes, yes, yes. You are glowing in the dark. Beautiful. Look at that. Not everybody can carry a stunning white dress. How are you? Okay, uh, please pose first for the... Okay, work it, work it, work it. Work it, work it. Work it. All right, let me get to your mic and, and pose away. Uh -huh. Face to the right. Face to the right. Quarter turn now. <laughs> okay. Are you done? Guys? Right. Oh, yeah, to the left. Yep. To the right. Uh, butt shot. <laughs> All right. Okay, my turn. <laughs> okay, please. Please sit down. Please sit down. I can interview you. Okay. Tracy, how has it been? How is your, um, you know, you won 2020. I mean, you were part of the pageant 2021. How has life been after that and during the pandemic? Well, it was very challenging, certainly. Um, even for my competition itself, it was also pushed back, just like the rest of the girls. Um, but after my Miss World competition, life has just been really amazing for me. I've had the time to really get back and really spend time with my family in the province. I've had some more time to do some travels. I've been to Japan recently, and I've just recently been to Shargao as well with my family. As you can probably see from my tan lines right now, but again, I've ha I have so many plans at the moment, and I'm just very grateful to be here. Thank you so much to Sir ALB, to the entire Blue Water Day Spa family, Miss Nancy, Miss Mary, Miss Anna. Thank you so much to all of you for the trust. I'm just so happy to be here. How, how do you, can you tell us briefly how your day goes and how you, how you incorporate uh, wellness and self-love? throughout your day? Well, for a typical day, I usually always started with a prayer. Um, just, and after that, a few, taking a few minutes to just really think about how my day would go, to the day, and to really set my intentions. And I think that's very important. You tell yourself that today is going to be a great day, today I'm going to be happy, because that also, I think that's a true, the true meaning of manifesting things. And Aside from that, it also really boils down to really putting in the work. It's always very important that you do at least a few hours of solid work every single day, maybe towards learning new things, going to work. And as for me, with the busy schedules, I also still incorporate relaxation and really taking the time to really invest in myself, invest in my well-being, my mental health. And that is why I'm also very happy that I get to be a part of the Blue Water Day Spa family because this is really the true essence of taking care of yourself and I think a lot of people might think of relaxation as a luxury but I hope that changes in the coming days and the coming years because it is definitely a necessity. It is very important that we really take care of ourselves, we stop neglecting ourselves. So guys, if we can start it with Blue Water Day Spa, we have to start it now. Wow, talagang rehearsed your answer niya. Next question, please ask me. No, but see, you can, like what I say, if you don't, if you don't practice what you preach, you can't say it with conviction, and you cannot, like, you know, you can't pretend. You can't pretend being well, you can't pretend looking good, if you're, you're not really good inside and out. So have you actually tried the treatments, and what is your favorite? Well, aside from the massage, of course, I always get my massages. If I can just get it every single day, I would. Um, aside from that, I would always normally go for the IPL hair removal treatments. Because in this line of business, in this industry, it's very important that we, um, we have smooth skin, uh, we remove unwanted hair, and especially for me, I have quite sensitive skin. So you know how it is when you always pluck and shave, it gets itchy, it can darken your skin, you can even get red patches. So for me, it's very important that I get those treatments. It's amazing that, you know, a spa like this has those treatments, because like yes. not everybody knows. When you think of spa, automatic massage. That's yes. it, massage, and then wala na. But amazing how extensive. So tell us about this, it's a laser, it's a hair removal. Hair removal. And how many times, 
I know it's like a couple of sessions before the actual thing. That's right. It has to be um, a couple of sessions before before you can actually start seeing the results. But ideally, you get the treatment every two weeks. That's the ideal span. And is it for laser, laser, right? Laser treatment. Yes. And that's for the legs, well, like, underarm, underarm. Can we see? <laughs> going on so maybe next time <laughs> <laughs> Thought I was oh my gosh so um the girls also told uh, us earlier about the korean v-lift have you tried any of the non-invasive uh, face treatments or are you are you willing to try that and, and experiment and, and, and check it out especially the oxygen the oxygen facial uh, yeah facial treatment i haven't really gotten the chance to try them yet, but that's the best part about being an ambassador, I guess. I get to try all these services and really share my experience to other people, like really tell from my experience how good it actually is, so that in the end, I could also encourage them to get the same treatments. I love your, your uh, what you said that, you know, treating yourself well or having, treat, uh, having going to a spa is not really a luxury. If you think about it, you spend eight hours a day working, making money for other people to, you know, you know, shampre, you have to spend on daily necessities. But in the end, what is it like treating yourself? Like if everybody even has a day off, why not yourself, right? That you can treat, you get like, okay, let's talk about something more exciting. How's your love life? Because mine is exciting. <laughs> The guy in, in black sweat. Black hat. All right, guys. I thought you were just taking a picture. Come, Samada. Anyo sayo. Have you heard of the uh, Korean V lift? <laughs> Maybe I tried it. Ah, can we call you on stage? <laughs> Let's interview you. Let's just say hello. So we can take your picture. Come on. What's your name? Jarel. Jarel? But you're half Filipino. You're poor, you're Korean? Who said you're Korean? Get out of here! Huh? Are you always, people always mistake him as Korean or maybe Japanese, but he's actually part Chinese. And the mom is Chinese. No. Okay. <laughs> what do you love most about your girlfriend? Say something nice. Everyone's listening. Her. Um, yes, I love everything about her. Um, I'm shy. Okay, that's enough. That's enough. All right. I'm just checking if I ask the right questions now. Okay, check. Check, check. Okay, how important is relaxation for you? Well, it's very important. It's of utmost importance for me. I treat it as if uh, that's just very similar to how I spend quality time with family. I guess that's the best time for myself. Also, um, relaxation, getting the time off for myself, just really getting the time to step back really rethink of my plans in the future to really have the time to re-energize and refuel my passion even. So it's really important for me. Okay. Where do you see yourself five years from now? Five That's not the question, but I just want to ask. Five years from now, I would be pretty old. <laughs> I Excuse me. <laughs> talk about old. Oh, no. <laughs> but um, by then, I would really have, uh, would love to have my own house, my own car, and really be able to give back to my family in the province, and have a stable career, and hopefully to have been able to start my own business as well. All right, I think we have asked all the questions. Uh, what else do you think? Do we have any questions from the audience? No. 
Yes. Anyway, yes. <laughs> not in me. You want to yes. ask me anything? Yes. Yes. <coughs> Hello, Tracy. Congratulations on your newest endorsement. I have a question. As a person who grew up in the province, what's the challenging part of living in the city? That's a very good question, Anna. Thank you. I'm a very proud provincial, as all of you might know. I grew up in Mindanao and also moved to Cebu. So the most challenging part for me would really have to be getting accustomed to the city life, the traffic, of course, the higher cost of living, definitely. And also just how busy it is here, how fast the day is. And I didn't realize how small our community actually was back then in the province until I moved here just recently about over, just a little over a year now. And that is actually something that I quite miss, just being friends with everyone in the neighborhood. But I'm very happy as well that I found my family here in Manila as well. Thank you. So galing. Okay, any more what is your? <clears throat> yes. Okay, uh, Tracy, I'm Nolly for okay before bright. Okay, as Miss World Philippines for 2021. Oh wait, there's what, a mic. Okay. Okay, thank you. Uh, as Miss World Philippines for 2021, what will be your best advice to aspiring beauty queens this year and to the next year? Pieces of advice. Um, I have a few actually. First is to, of course, I always say this. Never neglect your education. It's very important to always stay true to yourself. Be very strong with your principles. Know your values as a person. Because by the time comes when you get bombarded with so many ideas or even people telling you what to do, what not to do, you cannot get lost in the way because you already know who you are, what your plans are, what you want to be in life. And also just never forget where you came from and all the people that helped you. Thank you very much. Grabe. Example of beauty and praise. Okay, Naya. Grabe talaga. Any more? Okay, thank you so much. Um, again, thank you. Thank you. Thank you, for sharing your life. Thank you for sharing your Thank you for sharing your boyfriend. Thank you for, you know, just giving us a piece of your energy and that we, we wish you all the luck as of course the brand ambassador of Blue Water Day Spa. Thank Please you. make your way up the stage because we're going to do the next Thank you. Woo, Thank give you. Her a round of applause. Thank you everyone. Okay, we have to